Hey guys, this is Steve from Trim That Weed. In today's video, we're going to take a look at the meaning, causes, and how to fix Me Vacuum G10 Error Code 7. Get started. Me Vacuum G10 Error Code 7 indicates a problem with the robot's laser distance sensor. This error may be due to the sensor being dirty or obstructed, or it may indicate a more serious issue, requires technical assistance. The following are some of the causes of the Me Vacuum G10 Error Code 7 dirty or obstructed sensor. The laser distance sensor may become dirty or obstructed by dust, debris, or other materials, which can interfere with its ability to accurately detect the environment. Malfunctioning sensor. The sensor may malfunction due to a hardware or software issue, such as a damaged sensor or a firmware error. Environmental factors. Certain environmental factors, such as low light or reflective surfaces, may also interfere with the sensor's accuracy and cause the error code to appear. Now, let's look at the best solutions you can apply to fix the Mi Vacuum G10 error code 7. Clean the sensor. The first step is to clean the laser distance sensor with a soft, dry cloth. Ensure that no dirt or debris is blocking the sensor. To clean, turn off the robot and unplug it from the charger. Locate the laser distance sensor, which is usually located on the top of the robot. Use a soft, dry cloth to gently clean the sensor. Be careful not to scratch the sensor or apply too much pressure. Check for any dirt or debris that may be blocking the sensor and remove it using a clean, dry cloth. Once the sensor is clean, turn the robot back on and check if the error code has disappeared. Check the environment. Ensure that the robot is operating in a well-lit environment and that there are no reflective surfaces that could interfere with the sensor's accuracy. Reset the sensor. If the error persists, you can try resetting the sensor by removing it from the robot and then reattaching it. This may help resolve any hardware issues that may be causing the error code. To do this, turn off the robot. Locate the laser distance sensor on top of the robot. Remove the sensor from the robot by gently pulling it out. Reattach the sensor to the robot by aligning the pins on the sensor with the corresponding slots on the robot and pushing it in. Turn the robot back on and check if the error code has disappeared. Thanks for watching. 